Right now on your 13 Action News update, the World Health Organization is calling the monkeypox outbreak a global health emergency. The virus is now spread to more than 70 countries, with the CDC saying the U.S. is approaching 3,000 confirmed cases. Currently, New York, California, Florida, Illinois, and Georgia are among the states reporting the highest number of cases. Monkeypox vaccines are available in Las Vegas starting today. And with a limited supply, the Southern Nevada Health District is limiting who they'll offer appointments to. You can find out who is eligible at our website, ktnv.com. Health experts are again stressing the importance of vaccination and boosters when it comes to COVID-19. CDC data shows about two thirds of the population is fully vaccinated with at least their initial series, but less than one third of the population has gotten a booster shot. While vaccines that target new forms of the Omicron variant may be forthcoming, U.S. health officials say do not wait. Protect yourself now. Well, Metro police are investigating a homicide and a two vehicle crash. Investigators say two vehicles crashed at East Bonanza and North 22nd Street around 7.30 Thursday night. Officers then found one person with a gunshot wound. That person was taken to a hospital where they later died. Police are still looking for that gunman. If you have any information, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers. Justin. Thank you very much. You probably felt the humidity out there today. That's going to fuel some scattered showers and thunderstorms across our Monday afternoon, likely lingering into parts of Monday evening. Highs limited to about 100 degrees. We've seen a decent dose of clouds thus far today. We expect scattered showers and thunderstorms to contain some locally heavy rains, some lightning, potentially some brief gusty wind with the best chance of some of these downpours across Clark County kind of toward the latter part of Monday afternoon, but perhaps lingering into Monday evening. Tomorrow we do it all over again with lingering humidity, delivering another 40% chance of a thunderstorm back around 100 tomorrow. Now, Justin, as we tend to dry out a little bit Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, rain chance drops and temperatures start to heat up. All right, thank you. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktnv.com, and our free mobile app.